is Amberly, and I own and run Desert Heart Dairy Goats here in Yuma, Arizona. And for this evening's video, I have to get some bucks shaved because we are a few days out from their first show. So by the time that you guys see this video, it'll be a few days until the buck show. I am, however, shaving them almost two weeks in advance. That way their hair has time to fill out and grow in if need be. Um, so I'm pretty excited to get these smelly boys washed, clipped, and see how they do uh, for this upcoming show. So the two boys that I am taking is gonna be Zeus and Johnny. I would take Ryder, but unfortunately, it's just gonna be myself um, ha being a handler at this show. My sister does have prior arrangements. So it'll be just myself. So Zeus will be in the one-year-old class and Johnny will be in the two-year-old class. Ryder gets a break, so uh, he gets to stay home and relax. All right, so I was able to grab Johnny first. So he is a very, very big boy for two years old. I have been supplement feeding them uh, a show grain ration and it's done wonders. So uh, let's get this boy clipped. got Johnny all nice and blow dried right there. The reason I uh, just use a blower, which I just have it, um, I showed market animals, so I already have it on hand. It was already an expense um, that was spent, so we have it on hand, but anywho. Uh, the reason that I use a blower on him, it just saves time than just having to towel dry because you can't clip an animal when their fur is wet. If you clip an animal when the fur is wet, not only will it mess up your clippers, the motor itself, because it's gonna be working so much harder, you're gonna dull your blades really quickly. So please ensure that your animal is nice and dry to the touch, and your blades will do so much better. The reason that you give a bath before you clip them is so that the dirt doesn't gum up the blades. And when I say gum up the blades, it's gonna get in between those really fine teeth and again, dole your blades so much quicker. And if anyone knows, blades aren't that cheap to get um, sharpened. I mean, it takes time to send them off, to wait for them to get them back, yada, yada. So that's just one of the reasons why we bathe, clip, and blow dry. Um, or bathe, blow dry, and then clip our bucks. The blade size that I am using on Johnny this evening is a 4FC blade. Um, it's just a little bit longer um, cut blade. I'd love to use a seven on him. Unfortunately, my two sevens that I have on hand aren't clipping as sharply as I'd like, especially for this crazy mane of a coat that Johnny has on him. Four will do. I'll do a four on Zeus as well. I'll add some sevens to my uh, clipper box so that I can clip with a seven next time around, but this is what I have to work with, so. Oh, 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 oh,
quick way to trash your back. <laughs> Shave a goat. Face is super red. That looks so good. Anywho, almost done. Last but not least is to... So last but not least is to shave his legs with a 10 blade. It's my least favorite part of this whole thing. I know, that's crazy, but uh, I hate shaving legs. But with dairy goats, it's a must, so let's get it done because the sun, we're losing it. So let's get to going. <laughs> just about out of sunlight I got him done I got his feet trimmed his body clips his legs and head somewhat clip you do have to leave the beard on a buck um, but next up to get clipped is Zeus he will be tomorrow I will clip him tomorrow because it is getting dark and I don't want to be shaving at night but guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always if you haven't already please hit that subscribe button ding that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my videos and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.